bless you, my brother Remo. Praise God for you, my brother. Bless you, Sister Katrina. Duffy, bless you, Mother Myra. To God be the glory. Love you too, Mother, Ma Mother Mag. <laughs> Bless you. Hope you are having a wonderful day thus far. My big sister, Martha Mills. Bless you, darling. to Thursday Noonday Prayer. Sister Nicole. be the glory. Trusting that all is well with everyone. Praise God, I'm going to start reading from the Word of God. Psalms number 37, beginning at verse number 1. And I'm reading from the King James Version. And the Word of God say, Fret not thyself because of evildoers, neither be thy envious against the workers of iniquity. For they shall soon be cut down like the grass, and wither as the green herb. Trust in the Lord, and do good, and so shall thou dwell in the land, and verily thou shalt be fed. Delight thyself also in the Lord, and he shall give thee the desires of thy heart. 
Commit thy way unto the Lord. Trust also in him, and he shall bring it to pass. And he shall bring forth thy righteousness as the light, and thy judgment as the noonday. Rest in the Lord, and wait patiently for him. Fret not thyself because of him who prosper in his way, because of the man who bringeth wicked devices to pass. Cease from anger and forsake wrath. Fret not thyself in any wise to do evil, for evildoers shall be cut off. But those that wait upon the Lord, they shall inherit the earth. For yet for a little while, and the wicked shall not be. Yea, thou shalt diligently consider his place, and it shall not be. But the meek shall inherit the earth, and shall delight themselves in the abundance of peace. The wicked plotted against the just, and gnashed up on him with his teeth. The Lord shall laugh at him, for he see that his day is coming. The wicked have drawn out the sword and have bent the bow to cast down the poor and needy and to slay such as be of an upright conversation. Their sword shall enter into their own heart and their bows shall be broken. A little that a righteous man has is better than the riches of many wicked. For the arms of the wicked shall be broken, but the Lord uphold the righteous. The Lord know the days of the upright, and their inheritance shall be forever. They shall not be ashamed in the evil time, and in the days of famine they shall be satisfied. But the wicked shall perish, and the enemies of the Lord shall be as the fat of lambs. They shall consume until smoke shall they consume away. The wicked borroweth and payeth not again, but the righteous showed mercy and giveth. For such as be blessed of him shall inherit the earth. And they that be cursed of him shall be cut off. The steps of a good man are ordered by the Lord, and he delight in his way. Though he fall, he shall not be utterly cast down, for the Lord uphold him with his hand. Hallelujah. Verse 25. David said, I've been young. And now I am old, yet I've not seen the righteous forsaken, nor his seed begging bread. And he is ever merciful and lending, and his seed is blessed. Glory to God. Amen. Praise God for the word of God, for the people of God. So at this time, I invite you to let us all go before the throne of grace in the name of Jesus. The Bible says that we can go boldly. So, fathers, we come in humble submission. We come, dear God, thanking you for that privilege that we can call you our Father and that we can enter into your presence and cry, Abba, Father. We thank you, Father, that we have a blood bought right to have forgiveness of all of our sins, any sin that we've committed against you, Father, by word, by thought, or by deed, asking that you would have mercy upon us, knowing that you're rich in mercy. And we know that it's by your mercies that we've not been consumed because your compassion, it fails not. And we declare how great is your faithfulness and that you are our portion. So in you we will hope. Thank you for your goodness and your mercies following us all the days of our lives. 
And you said, however our Lord and Savior Jesus Christ is, said that it would be like him with you in eternity forever. So, Father, we thank you, dear God, for our salvation that is safe and secure in you and in our Lord and Savior Jesus Christ. And in God, the Holy Spirit, that no one is able to pluck us from out of your hands. So we holler your name, dear God. We holler your name, Elohim, the creator of the heavens and of the earth. You created us and you crowned us with glory and honor. You're the God of might and strength. We holler your name, El Shaddai. You're the God almighty of blessings. You're the breasted one who nourishes and supplies an all bountiful and all sufficient God. We holler your name, Adonai, our Lord and Master. You're Jehovah, the complete self-existing one, was always present revealed in Jesus Christ, who is the same yesterday, today, and forever. We holler your name, Jehovah Jireh. You're the one who sees all of our needs and provides for us. We holler your name, Jehovah Nisi, our victory and our banner. Banner over is your love. For every time the enemy tries to come upon us like a flood, you lift up a standard against him. And we holler your name, Jehovah Makedes, the God who sanctified us and set us apart for your service. We holler your name, Jehovah, to set canoe, and God our righteousness. For you made him who knew no sin to become sin for us, and we might become the righteousness of God in Christ Jesus. We holler your name, Jehovah Rapha, you're the Lord that healeth. God, that make bitter spirits sweet. For you sent your word and forgive us for all of our iniquities and heal us from every sickness and disease. We holler your name, huh? Jehovah Shalom, you are with peace. Then all these troubles time, your peace that pass all understanding, keeping our hearts and keeping our minds through Christ Jesus. We holler your name, Jehovah Rohi, you are with shepherd. And we don't want for any good or beneficial thing. We holler your name, Jehovah Shammah. Say, you never leave us or forsake us. You always there when we need you. And we can feel confidence and be encouraged that we can boldly say that what can men do unto us with you on our side? And we holler your name, El El Yon, the most high God, first cause of everything. Possess of the heavens and of the earth. You are the everlasting God, the living God, the almighty God, the great God, the merciful God. Your true justice, righteousness, and perfection. Bel Perizan, you're the God that break forth. Yeshua Hamashiach, Yahweh, our strong tower, our mighty battle axe, our lily of the valley. Bright in the morning star, the rose of Sharon, the Holy One from Mount Perrin, Emmanuel, the Lion of Judah, Melchizedek, that I am that I am God. Hosanna, the only wise God, the true and the living God, the shepherd and bishop of our soul, the living water, the living bread, the living door, the good shepherd, the way, the truth, and the life, the resurrection and the life, the living water, the living bread, the living door, the good shepherd. Oh, hallelujah. Hallelujah. Uh, the Alpha and Omega, the beginning and the end, the first and the last, Shiloh, the root of David, the bomb in Gilead, God of the ancient, he that opens the door and no man can close it. He that closes the door and no man can open it. Our Redeemer, he that which was dead, but is alive forevermore. For we read the story that one Sunday morning, hallelujah, you got up and declared that all power in heaven and earth is in your hand. So God, we thank you right now that the same power that raised up Jesus from the dead is it's alive today. The same power is going to raise us up, dear God, in that last day. 
and we'll all be caught up to meet you in the air, dear God. Oh, in the name of Jesus. And God, we thank you right now. Thank you, God. Blessing us to lie down and rest, dear God. Hallelujah. And God, when we lie down to rest, <laughs> it wasn't no written notice that we would wake up this morning. But God, we thank you for your menacing angels watching all over us last night. Hallelujah. And Lord, you decide to wake us up early this morning to a brand new day we had never seen before. And God, as you awaken us, you've given us all our senses, dear God. Water, food, and clothes, the shelter was still standing, dear God. And we had a mind, dear God, to lift up our eyes into the hills from which cometh our help. And realize that all of our help comes from nobody but you. And oh, we take the time out. We don't take it lightly. We say, thank you, God. Thank you for all your blessings. Thank you, God. Oh, hallelujah. Thank you, God. And hallelujah for bringing us through every trial and through every tribulation, dear God. You said that our faith would be tried. That we ought to counter all joy when we fall in the divers temptations. Knowing that the trial of our faith work at patience. And you said for us to let patience have its perfect work. And we may be entire and complete, lacking nothing, dear God. And God, we thank you right now, dear God. For we read in your word, no matter what we go through, no matter what we have to face, dear God, you say that all things work together for good. Those who love you and those who are called according to your purpose. So, oh God, we thank you right now. We don't mind giving you a praise, dear God. We don't mind your word of all the praises and all the glory, all the honor. So we don't mind saying hallelujah to you. We don't mind saying glory to your name, dear God. Hallelujah. Thank you for where you brought us. Thank you for everything that you taught us. Thank you for filling us with your Holy Spirit. Thank you for never leaving us or forsaking us, dear God. In the name of Jesus, even when, dear God, and Lord, we slip and fail, dear God. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. When we made mistakes, dear God, and when you send your word, you say, where sin abound, grace even more abound, dear God. So we thank you for your amazing grace. How sweet the sound. Save the rest like us. You said the law was given by Moses, but one day grace and truth showed up. God, we thank you right now. Oh, in the name of Jesus, thank you, God. And we understand why it's called that amazing grace. You didn't give us what we rightly deserve. You gave us what we didn't deserve. So, God, we take the time out and we say thank you, Lord. In the name of Jesus, thank you, God. Hallelujah. And you're the only one that's perfect in all your ways, dear God. No matter what we have to deal with, whatever we have to go through, whatever you allow to happen, dear God, you're the only one that's perfect in all your ways. You don't make any mistakes, dear God. And God, we thank you right now, Lord, that we can trust in you with all our heart, dear God. Hallelujah. And lean not to our own understanding. And you said in every way, dear God, that we are to acknowledge you and you to, to direct our path. Let all your people know that you're concerned about every area of our lives, dear God. In the name of Jesus, God, because you see us no matter where we go, no matter what we do, dear God, there's no hiding place from you. No matter where we make our bed at, dear God, you are already there, dear God. Hallelujah. Thank you, dear God, that you are, dear, that you are omniscient, God. Lord, you see everything. Hallelujah. And you know everything, dear God. You're omnipresent. You're the same place all over at the same time. You're always present. Hallelujah. And when we're weak, we know we got an omnipotent God. An all-powerful God. There's no one or nothing more powerful than you. And God, we say thank you right now. You say that we that are weak, 
we that are strong supposed to bear the infirmities of the weak. And even in our weakness, dear God, your strength will step in, dear God. Oh, in the name of Jesus. And God, we thank you right now. Because sometime, and if we be honest with you, sometime we feel like we wanted to give up, dear God. But we read in your word, dear God, you said, dear God, hallelujah, hallelujah. In the name of Jesus, to be not weary and well torn. Hallelujah. That we that we'd keep on trying and keep on being strong, dear God. Hallelujah. Do season is near. And God, we thank you right now. Thank you, Lord. Somebody been trying a long time and they've been ready to throw up their hands, dear God. But Lord, in the name of Jesus, we thank you for your ministering angels, dear God. Hallelujah. No, you have a you have a sign to all of your children, dear God. They are ministering to all of the children who are heirs of salvation. And we know that we are our salvation, saved by the blood of Jesus. Hallelujah. Washed in his blood. In the name of Jesus. And God, we thank you right now. Thank you, Lord. We live and move and we have our being in you. That we are seated together in heavenly places in Christ Jesus. And you will bless us with all spiritual blessings in heavenly places in Christ Jesus. You've given us everything to life and godliness in the name of Jesus. So we thank you, God. Thank you, Father. That we can stand on your word. Said before your word fell, heaven and earth would pass away. And God, we thank you right now. Lord, bless all the family. In the name of Jesus, hallelujah. Let the church start in the home, dear God. In the name of Jesus, bless that man of God. Let him realize that he is somebody in Christ Jesus. That he is the priest in his home, dear God. In the name of Jesus. And God, we thank you right now. In the name of Jesus, that he be a man of prayer, dear God. In the name of Jesus, overseer of his home, dear God. In the name of Jesus, bless him, dear God. Be a good steward in his home, dear God. In the name of Jesus, strengthen him where he's weak. Build him up where he's been torn down, dear God. In the name of Jesus, bless him, dear God, to labor with his hands, earn his living, dear God. You said if a man doesn't take care of his family, he is worse than an infidel and has denied the faith. So God, give them that strength. Give them that encouragement that they need. At every level that you bring them to, dear God, that he has the anointing that he needs, dear God. In the name of Jesus, Lord, that he started to be show himself approved unto you. Be that work unto God. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. That rightly divided in the word of God. In the name of Jesus. Thank you, God, that he loved his wife. Hallelujah. As the Christ, as Paul compared the, the marriage to family, to church, and God. In the name of Jesus. Let him love his wife as Christ loved the church. Christ said upon this rock, he would build his church. And the gates of hell would not prevail against it. So let him love his wife as Christ loved the church. And willing to give his life for it, dear God. Oh, in the name of Jesus. Father, thank you, God. Bless them both to be prayer warriors, dear God. In the name of Jesus. Lord, let them all let them speak the same thing. In the name of Jesus. Let that woman submit herself unto her own husband, dear God. Hallelujah. In the name of Jesus, as she would do unto the Lord, according to your word, dear God. Not just something I'm making up, dear God. In the name of Jesus, when she's filled that love, that man loving her as Christ loved the church. Oh, in the name of Jesus, Lord, let us submit herself to our own husband. In the name of Jesus, bless her be that Proverbs 31 woman. Oh, in the name of Jesus, dear God. And God bless all the children. Hallelujah, right now. Lord, let them train up the children in the way they should go. And when they're old, they won't stray away. Lord, the family is so important to God. In the name of Jesus, will stop dying. And he was concerned about his mother, dear God. 
before salvation was complete. Hallelujah. I told John, take care of mother. So God, we thank you that you first, the family and then the church, dear God. Lord, let the children, dear God, obey their parents in the Lord. In the name of Jesus, let not the parents provoke their children into anger, dear God. In the name of Jesus, bless our babies as they go out, dear God, for their education, dear God. When it's time for them to leave home, dear God. Hallelujah. Lord, let their light shine, dear God, before men that they see their good works, but that you be glorified. Bless them to be an example for all other young people and all who be around them, dear God. In the name of Jesus, let them not be ashamed to claim to call on the name of Jesus at any time, dear God. And we thank you right now, God. Let them never be weary and well-doing. Let them keep their eyes on the prize, dear God. In the name of Jesus. And God, we thank you right now, God. And we say glory to your name, dear God. Let the family, dear God, be in order, dear God. Let them be, dear God, in order to no, we won't have no dysfunction of families. And Lord, that's where the church started. At. And God, when they come into the assembly of the saints, we won't have a dysfunction of the church, dear God. Oh, in the name of Jesus. And God, we thank you right now. Hallelujah. And even when our babies might stray away, dear God. Lord, our teachers, dear God, will show up in their life one day and bring them back down memory lane. In the name of Jesus, bless them to stay on the straight and narrow path. Oh, glory to your name. And God, we thank you right now. In the name of Jesus, thank you, God, for blessing each and every ministry of the body of Christ, dear God. In your word, you say, you set all the members in the body of Christ, Father, as it pleases you, and not man, dear God. In the name of Jesus, thank you, God, for each and every under-shepherd you placed over your people, dear God. You said you give us pastors after your own heart who will shepherd the flock of God, who will feed the flock of God. In the name of Jesus, and God, we thank you right now for blessing every apostle, every prophet, every evangelist, every pastor, every teacher, every missionary, every bishop, every deacon, every elder, dear God. And you said it'd be for the equipping of the saints, for the work of the ministry, for the edifying of the body of Christ, dear God. Bless them all to be one, Father, as you, Father, and our Lord and Savior, Jesus Christ, and God, the Holy Spirit. Thank you, God, for blessing our man of God. Hallelujah, our Pastor Ethan Z. McDuffie. Hallelujah, watchman on the wall, a faithful servant of the Most High God, a man who loved God and loved God's people, dear God. A man who's been steadfast and unmovable, always abounding in the work of the Lord. Thank you, Lord, that his labor is not in vain, dear God. Thank you for blessing his children. Charity, charisma, so William, dear God. In the name of keeping them, dear God, covering them with the blood of Jesus. Thank you for blessing Mother Myra McDuffie. Hallelujah. A mighty woman of God, dear God. Thank you, God, for blessing and keeping her, dear God. Hallelujah, dear God. Thank you that she's an intercessing mother. In the name of Jesus, bless Keith McDuffie. In the name of Jesus, let him know, and this too will come to pass. In the name of Jesus, and God bless the ministry that you've given. Oh, glory to your name. Bless them, dear God. Cover them with the blood of Jesus. Thank you, God, for blessing the pastor with the wisdom and knowledge and understanding and discernment that comes straight down from heaven, dear God. Hallelujah. Thank you, God, for blessing them, dear God, to be a blessing. Blessing them with overflow, supernatural abundance, dear God. In the name of Jesus, all in his steps in your word, dear God. Let that word be a living word on the inside of them, dear God. 
and God the same for Pastor Jackson and Leslie Moore, Shekana and Jackson Moore Jr. and their family, Sister Leslie's mother, dear God, in the name of Jesus, in the same way, dear God, you know respect of person. And you said the anointing flows from the head down to the beard, to the skirts of the garment, dear God. In the name of Jesus. And God, we thank you right now. Let the anointing flow down into the ministry, dear God. In the name of Jesus. Bless us all to be one. All your children to be one as you, Father. And our Lord and Savior, Jesus Christ. And God, the Holy Spirit is one. Thank you, God. In the name of Jesus. You say that we that are strong, Pose a bad infirmities of the weak, dear God. Any time a brother is caught in the fault, dear God, you say we need to go to him, dear God. Take one and go to him. And Lord, if they don't listen, then said, bring them before the assembly, dear God. That they be chasing of you, Father, in the name of Jesus. Thank you, God, for blessing us to preserve our bodies as a living sacrifice holy and acceptable unto you, which is our reasonable service, dear God. In the name of Jesus, and God, to be not conformed to this world, but be transformed by the renewing of our minds, that we may prove what is that good and acceptable and perfect will of yours. Lord, that we realize who we are in Christ. We are chosen generation, a holy nation. We are raw priesthood. We are peculiar people. Lord, that we can show forth the praises of him who have called us from out of darkness unto your marvelous light, dear God. Lord, let our light shine, dear God, in our home and before men. Father, that they see our good works, but God, that you be glorified. We know you don't share your glory with no one, dear God. So, Father, we give you all the praises and the glory. Hallelujah. In the name of Jesus. And God, we thank you right now, God. In the name of Jesus. Thank you, Lord. Hallelujah, dear God. Bless us, dear God to think on the things that are true, honest, and just, things that are pure, lovely, and of good report, things that are praiseworthy, things that are excellent, dear God. Hallelujah. And you said the God of peace would be us, be with us, dear God. And Lord, that we add to our faith virtue, dear God, and to virtue knowledge, and to knowledge temperance, and to temperance patience, and to patient godliness, and to godliness brotherly kindness, and to brotherly kindness love, dear God, in the name of Jesus. For you said, he that loveth not, don't even know you, dear God. Because you are love, that's who you are, dear God, in the name of Jesus. And God, we thank you right now. We thank you, God. Lord, for you place all the members in the body as it pleases you, dear God. And Paul said there's a more excellent way, a way called love, dear God. Hallelujah. Though we can speak, dear God, of the glory of heaven and the tragedies of hell, dear God. And if we have not love, you say we like a sound and brass and a tingling cymbal, dear God. We have our empty sound. Hallelujah, dear God. Father, we thank you, God. Let your love abound in all your children, dear God. You said men will know we are your disciples if we have love for one another, dear God. Oh, in the name of Jesus. And we know, Father, when the church started out, everybody had something in common, dear God. Those that had lack, dear God. Those that had more, they sold their land, sold houses, dear God. Hallelujah. And they brought all the money to the apostles, dear God where everybody could have, a, hallelujah, be divided equally among the brethren, dear God. And those that kept back, God, oh God Almighty, let us not hold back, dear God. In the name of Jesus, because they had to, they gave up the ghost, dear God, right before the apostles' feet. In the name of Jesus. So, God, when we make a vow to you, dear God, bless us to keep that vow. Otherwise, don't make it at all. In the name of Jesus. And, God, we thank you right now. We thank you, dear God, that the weapons of our warfare, 
Hallelujah. They are not colonel, but mighty through God to pull them down on the stronghold. Lord bless us to cast down every imagination and every high thing that exalt itself against the knowledge of God and bring into captivity every thought to the obedience of Christ, realizing you can do exceeding and abundantly above all we can ever ask or think according to the power that you work in us. Realize we're not wrestling against flesh and blood, but against powers principalities, rulers of darkness of this world, spiritual weakness in high places. Hallelujah. You said for us to be strong in the Lord and in the power of his might. Hallelujah. Put on the whole armor of God and we may be able to stand against the wiles of the enemy. And you never told us to take it off till God in the name of Jesus. Having on the lawns girded with the truth. Hallelujah. Blessed prayed of righteousness. Feet shod with the preparation of the gospel of peace. And you said, above all, put on the shield of faith to quench all the old fiery dots of the wicked. And the helmet of salvation and the sword of the spirit, which is the word of God. Praying always with all prayer and supplication in the spirit. And watching out for perseverance for all saints, that doors be open to the ministry of your word, and that your word would have free course. Touch not your knowing it, and do your prophets no harm, dear God. Oh, in the name of Jesus. So, God, we thank you right now, God. Thank you, Lord. Lord, we believe, dear God. Hallelujah. And as your word goes out, dear God, it will not come back void. It will accomplish what you sent it out to do. It will prosper in that thing that you sent it to prosper in. Because your word is quick and powerful, sharper than any two-edged sword, piercing even to the dividing of, of the soul and spirit and of the joints and the marrow. Hallelujah. The worlds were framed by the word of God. All things are held together by your word. Faith cometh by hearing and hearing by your word. You said, dear God, without faith uh, is impossible to please you. That he that come to you, we got to believe, dear God. It's not an option. We got to believe, dear God, who you are and that you are a rewarder of them that diligently seek him. The great I am that I am God. Oh, hallelujah. And God, we thank you right now. Lord, we believe right now. We come together. We believe right now, dear God, in the name of Jesus. Lord, hallelujah. Lord, we believe, dear God, your word works or we'll work the word, dear God. We send your word right now to every hospital right now, dear God. Every convalescent home, every mental institution, every rehab center, every hospital center, dear God. Some on the streets of the world, dear God. Somebody getting ready, mentally ill, getting ready to take their lives, dear God. But God, we send your word to them right now. Lord, let your healing power, hallelujah, step into place, dear God. Let the word become flesh right now in their lives, dear God. In the name of Jesus. And God, we thank you right now. We thank you, God, that that word is going to accomplish right now. Lord, what you sent it out to do right now, dear God. Healing power. Hallelujah. Remember those in surgery rooms right now, God. God, the physician's hands, dear God. All the anesthesiologists and all the nurses and hallelujah. In the name of Jesus, we send your word, dear God, to all those, dear God, on life support. <coughs> Oh, hallelujah, right now, God, in the name of Jesus, let them know you the true life support, ah, that we live and move and have our being in you, dear God, in the name of Jesus, that when they take the life support off, dear God, let them know that you still almighty God, hallelujah, dear God, according to your perfect will for each life right now, in the name of Jesus, dear God. Remember all the destitute, dear God. Lord, somebody lost something from the all of the disasters that's been going on. Hallelujah, dear God. Saved and unsaved folk. 
Lord, in the name of Jesus, only you can restore, dear God. All you need to do is speak a word, dear God. Hallelujah, dear God. Men have to obey, dear God, in the name of Jesus. Lord, that you can restore right now. In the name of Jesus, remember all those who lost their freedom, dear God. Some in prisons and jail houses and, and juvenile homes, dear God. In the name of Jesus, Lord, I don't know whether they're guilty or it's not for us to judge. But God, you know the hearts and minds of every man and every woman, dear God. And we know one thing, Father, who you set free is free indeed, dear God. But God, we thank you that you got those that go in behind the walls, dear God. They may be locked up from society. But they're not locked up from you, dear God. Some is receiving that word, dear God. A life-changing word, a telemade word just for them, Father. In the name of Jesus, remember all the unwedded mother's homes, dear God. Let it not be a lifestyle for them. Oh, in the name of Jesus, let them know that you got a man, dear God. A M-A-L-E, a male, hallelujah. A man of God who will love them and love their children, dear God. In the name of Jesus, remember all, dear God, all the widows and the widowers, all the motherless and the fatherless, dear God, all the bereaved heart ones, in the name of Jesus. And God, we thank you right now, Father, in the name of Jesus. Lord, hallelujah, giving peace to their hearts and their minds, dear God. In the name of Jesus. And God, we thank you right now. We believe right now, Father, that you raising up our down heads. You giving peace to troubled minds right now. In the name of Jesus. And God, we thank you right now. Bless all the veterans, dear God. Some, dear God, lost their life. Hallelujah for this country, dear God. In the name of Jesus, bless all their families. Give their families peace in their hearts and minds, dear God. In the name of Jesus, meet every need, dear God. Hallelujah, and the wise desires of their hearts, Father. Remember the president and vice president. Hallelujah, bless them with the wisdom and knowledge and understanding that comes from you. Bless them to make wise decisions, dear God. Hallelujah, in their services, dear God. And in our personal lives, dear God, in the name of Jesus. And God, we thank you right now. Thank you for the anointing, dear God. Lord, that all your children need. Bless us to have effective services for you. In the name of Jesus, whether it's corporate time or whether it's solo time, in the name of Jesus, dear God. Father, we thank you right now, God. Hallelujah. Thank you, Lord, Father. That, Lord, that we won't waste our time in prayer, dear God. For you said, affection, fervent prayer of a righteous man availed much. Hallelujah. And we know we're only righteous in Jesus Christ. In the name of Jesus. And, God, we thank you right now. So we pray for the lost right now. Oh, hallelujah, dear God. Hallelujah, somebody, dear God. They have hardened their hearts, dear God. They're down in the church, dear God. They're speaking against you, Father. But God, as Jesus did, when I thought they nailed him up to the cross, after they nailed him to the cross, he said, Father, forgive them, for they don't know what they're doing. So, so God, forgive them. They don't know what they're saying, dear God, in the name of Jesus. So God, would you bless right now, God. Stir up that word in their hearts, in the name of Jesus. Lord, bring all the particles back home, dear God. Somebody's gotten mad, dear God. I know what it is, dear God, to want to get out of a, hallelujah, get out of a fellowship with the church, dear God. But God, you strengthened me and you, you brought me into the right place, dear God. I never forget that Sunday morning, dear God, 14 and a half years ago, dear God, met a man named Ethan McDuffie and a woman named Ross McDuffie, the God mighty man and woman of God, and made a difference in our lives, dear God. And God, we thank you right now, Father. So God, raise up, dear God, intercessors all over the land, dear God. You said men are always to pray and not faint, dear God. And God, we thank you right now. We thank you right now, God, that you hear and answer all of our prayers, dear God, in the name of Jesus. 
Some might be delayed, hallelujah, but not denied. Sometime you say no, dear God, because we're not ready for it yet. Hallelujah, that so many are still babes, dear God, in the name of Jesus. They got to have the milk. They're not ready for the meat of the word right now, Father, in the name of Jesus. And God, we thank you right now, God, in the name of Jesus. Thank you, Lord, for the Holy Ghost power moving in every home right now. All your children's home, wherever they are, dear God, sanctify the home, dear God, in the name of Jesus. Let it be a dwelling place, dear God, Lord, that you can come in, dear God, and fellowship with your children, dear God, no matter where the home is, dear God, in the name of Jesus. Thank you, God. Hallelujah. Let the blood of Jesus overshadow all your children and everything that you blessed us with and will bless us with. Hallelujah. And God, we thank you right now, dear God. And we believe right now. You said everything is possible if we only believe, dear God. And we believe that you're working it out right now, dear God, for somebody who's about ready to give up, dear God. While we're trying to figure it out, you already have worked it out, dear God. In the name of Jesus. And God, we thank you right now, God, for testimony is all over the land. Hallelujah. Coming from the north and the south and the east and the west, dear God. Hallelujah. Talking about the goodness of our good, good Father. In the name of Jesus. <coughs> and God, we thank you right now. Hallelujah. And Holy Spirit, we're saying, have your way, dear God, to all those who are listening to my voice right now in the name of Jesus. Have your way, dear God, in their lives, dear God. Meet every need, dear God, right now, Father, in the name of Jesus. And all the wise desires of their hearts, dear God, according to your perfect will for each life, anything that's in line with holy living, dear God. In the name of Jesus. And God, you say, of any of us touching the greed, dear God, about anything, hallelujah, you said, dear God, you would be in the midst, dear God. So, Father, we thank you right now. Thank you, God. Hallelujah. And, Lord, we said, dear God, we read in your word, you say, whatever we bind down here on earth, you said your co-sign for us, you would back us up in heaven. And whatever we loose down here on earth, you said you'd back us up. You'd loose it in heaven. You'd co-sign for us. So, Father, in the name of Jesus, all that's listening right now, dear God, hallelujah. We know the enemy come to steal, kill, and destroy, dear God, in the name of Jesus. But, God, you said you give us power to walk and tread on serpents and scorpions and over all the power of the enemy right now. Now, in the name of Jesus, and all who believe that right now, in the name of Jesus, Lord, we bind every demonic force, every ruler of darkness, every spiritual weakness in high places. We break the power of your silence and rhythm in the north right now. Ah, not in our name, but in the name of Jesus the Christ, the Son of the living God. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. And we loose the Holy Spirit in his gift. We loose your miracle work and power. Hallelujah. In the name of Jesus. So God, we thank you right now. We thank you, God. Hallelujah. Hallelujah, dear God, for touching right now, God. Somebody need a touch. <laughs> from the master's hand, dear God, in the name of Jesus. Lord, we know that one touch from you can change everything, dear God, in the name of Jesus. So, God, in the name of Jesus, Lord, we ask, dear God, a touch from the master's hand, in the name of Jesus. Thank you right now, dear God. Let the Holy Ghost power, 
Hallelujah, dear God. Lord, fill, refill us with your Holy Spirit. In the name of Jesus the Christ. Hallelujah. John said, I baptize with water. But there's one coming mightier than him who going to baptize with the Holy Ghost, dear God. Lord, anyone that haven't been filled with the Holy Ghost, Lord, fill right now. In the name of baptize with the Holy Ghost, dear God. You said, dear God, we shall receive power after the Holy Ghost come upon us. In the name of Jesus, the power, dear God, to be a witness for you, dear God. The power to be labors together with you, dear God. Hallelujah. Paul said, we have this ministry in earthly vessels. Hallelujah. In the name of Jesus. Thank you right now, dear God. Thank you, God. And Lord, we thank you for blessing the symbol of all your saints together. Hallelujah. This Thanksgiving month, dear God. Hallelujah. Whenever the saints come together, dear God. Hallelujah. Let us have a glorious time. Let us celebrate you in the name of Jesus. Let us celebrate with one accord, dear God, in the name of Jesus. Let us put on the garment of praise for the spirit of heaviness, dear God. And Lord, we thank you. Thank you and we say glory to your name. Hallelujah. And Father, we thank you right now. Thank you for, dear God, all those who allow my voice to come into their presence, dear God. And Lord, I've, we've given you back your word because you watch over your word to perform it. Hallelujah. We know our word don't mean nothing, dear God. But your word means everything. In the name of Jesus. So, Father, we thank you, God. Thank you for your ministering angels, dear God, that they had worked right now on behalf of your children, dear God. Or in the name of Jesus, he said they are ministering to those of us who are heirs of salvation, dear God. And God, we thank you right now. Thank you, God. Breathe on your children, dear God. Refresh us right now, God, in the name of Jesus. Keep hope alive, Father. In the name of Jesus, thank you, God. Thank you, Lord. And Father, we give you all the praises for it in advance. We found out, Father, that we don't have to wait till the battle is won. Hallelujah. God, we can give you a praise right now. We can give you a hallelujah right now. We can give you a glory, glory right now in advance, dear God. In the name of Jesus, we believe that you're still in the fixing business. Oh, hallelujah right now, God. In the name of Jesus, God, we thank you, God. Hallelujah. Lord, that we believe only your report, dear God. Hallelujah. We believe your report, dear God. You have the foul say so about everything in the name of Jesus. Hallelujah. And God, we just say thank you right now. This Thanksgiving month, we thank you, God. Some trying to get ready for Christmas. And God, they're forgetting all about the most important thing. Lord, that you saved us and baptized us with your Holy Ghost, dear God. Jesus gave his life as a ransom for us. So, God, we can say thank you right now. We have a lot of thanks in our hearts. Oh, glory to God. Hallelujah. God, we thank you, God. Thank you, God. Thank you that you're the author and you're the finisher of our faith. Hallelujah. He that started a good work in us, hallelujah, you're going to finish it. Hallelujah. Oh, in the name of Jesus. So, God, we thank you right now, God. Thank you for your knowing and power in every assembly of the saints, dear God. Hallelujah. Thank you, dear God. And we give you all the praises. Hallelujah. Glory to God. Thank you. We give you all the glory and all the honor. Hallelujah. Well, we give it all to you, dear God. We can't brag on nobody else, dear God. We got to brag on you, dear God. 
who's our way maker, our miracle worker, our promise keeper, our light in the darkness, dear God. Thank you, God. Does somebody right now need traveling grace? Hallelujah, dear God. In the name of Jesus. Somebody right now need a breakthrough, God. Oh, in the name of Jesus. In the name of Jesus. Thank you for giving the telemed word to all the ministers of your word, dear God. For the assembling of your saints, dear God. Whether it's tonight or tomorrow or Sunday, dear God. On the Lord's day. Thank you for the tailor-made word, dear God. Thank you for the anointing on the lives of those, all the musicians and the praise teams, dear God. The choirs, hallelujah. Those who are working behind the scene, dear God. In the name of Jesus, thank you for sanctifying, purifying every place you place your name. Oh, in the name of Jesus, thank you that some buildings are still being restored, dear God. But thank you that the building is not the church. It's just a gathering place for the church. That the church still goes on. And God, we thank you right now. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. And that name that's above every name that's a name. Always remember, whatever you're going with, whatever you're dealing with, it's got a name. And his name is above that name. I'm talking about the name of the mighty and the majestic name of Jesus Christ, who is King of Kings, who is rulers of rulers, who is Lord of Lords. Hallelujah. And God, we thank you right now, Father. We thank you right now. Hallelujah. And we say amen. We say amen. And we say amen. Hallelujah. Meaning that so be it. That it is well with our soul, dear God. Hallelujah. Oh, in the name of Jesus. And God, we thank you, God. And I praise God for each and every one of you for, hallelujah, allowing my voice to come into your presence. <clears throat> Glory to God. Hallelujah. I'm Billy Free. I'm under the leadership of a great man of God, our pastor Ethan Z. McDuffie from the Palace of Praise Church in Spring, Texas. Hallelujah. Glory to God. And it's a little bitty Billy Free saying, God bless you. Have a blessed, wonderful day. In the name of Jesus Christ. Hallelujah. I love you all. May God bless and forever keep you. Amen.